offensive boards. Yeah, very much so. As, uh, yeah, offensive boards, uh, the Cougar, yeah, 18 overall for the game, 13 defensive, out-rebounded them 50 to 46. Yeah, 18 offensive rebounds. <laughs> that is really, really good. And there was other times we got in there, got our hands on it. We didn't cut, quite come up with the rebound, but still, those are um, great hustle plays, and they all add up. Another impressive stat tonight right here in the T.O. column, only six tonight. Well, <laughs> I hope that's accurate. It felt like a lot more than six. Uh, that, like I talked about the rain fight, I thought in that period we must have had six alone. But um, I guess that's that just could be the way it felt. It. I don't know. Six, I'll take that number every night. Yeah. Dylan Hyder, career night in a Cougar uniform tonight, 27 points. Yeah, he liked that zone. <laughs> he did. Yeah, he's... Uh, He's a really good shooter. I mean, it took him a couple games to get, um, I don't know, acclimated or whatever, but the last three games yeah. now, he's just been on fire. Um, and it's kind of one of those shots, too, when it goes up, you just know it's going in. Yeah. Uh, yeah, James Pendleton with 16 tonight. Typical game for James. Yep, James is going to have those 16, 20s and basically go under the radar because he makes it look so easy. Yeah. And, and, and he's getting to the basket a lot. Um, and, you know, these guys are pretty athletic, so he, he might have got a few blocked or whatever, but yeah. he's, uh, he, he's going to keep going like that in the UMAC and get a lot of points. Yeah, KJ with 15. Carlin, uh, 10 points tonight, 5 of 7. Good moves for the, the, the man in the middle. Yep, it's it's confidence it's, with him. Yeah. And, um, you know, we, we see things with him on film, and we show it to him, and he gets it. It's, he's yeah. really fun to work with. Um, but that nice little baby hook down there, he's got yeah. good footwork, good hands. Uh, the confidence is going to come with him, and he and uh, he and Jarrett working together in that high-low post area stuff for the next four years will be a lot of fun to watch. Okay, so uh, now a couple of road games coming up. Got a little exhibition down in Marshall coming up. Yeah, we go there on uh, Friday. Um, Coach Bigler and his squad, we haven't been there, I bet, in, I don't know, eight or nine years. Yeah. So it'll be fun to go back there for, uh, for an exhibition. We like to play those exhibition games a little bit earlier in the year, not when we're playing the regular season, but... I'll tell you, as a guy that does the schedule, it's hard to get <laughs> games in, and at some point you just take them where you can get them. Yeah. And that's kind of the case with them and with um, then you go to Moorhead, Moorhead next week yeah, on Monday. I mean, that's not an ideal night with the with the Tuesday game. Um, but like I said, we're just, you know, last fall when we're working on this, you get to the last two or three games, and you're just jamming them in there, and that's what happened to these two. All right, yeah, then you return home December 3rd and December, uh, December 7th. Mayville State on the third and the conference opener on the seventh against Northland. Yeah, and like I said, that seems like it was so far off, but I, it's not. It's coming up. Yeah, quick. it's not. And, you know, after a game like this, the way we're played, it's like we can't get to it quick enough. Yeah. Yeah, well, yeah, you got a solid foundation coming off this game tonight. Yep. No, I really like how we played. Um, he said that, that those offensive rebounds, we've been really working on that, preaching that. <laughs> and I like the way that's going. <laughs> All right, the time we need to uh, duck for cover here the way it looks. And, well, congratulations on the win. We'll catch up with you in a couple right. of weeks again. Sounds, Thanks, sounds Paul. Good. Thank you very much. Head coach Paul Gore with us here as the Cougars win 90-68 to over presentation.